Yo guys, what is up? It is Riley here. Welcome back to another YouTube video on my channel. This is a GT5 um, top five video. Um, I've decided to do some of these videos every now and then. Um, so if you guys don't know, I really enjoy drifting on GT5. Um, me, my mate Curtis and Maddie, we all go drifting every now and then, as well as off-roading and dirt bike riding and all that stuff. We like to do all this sort of roleplay stuff. So this is okay, a top five um, drift spots. This is my, mine and Curtis's and Maddie's. Um, so it's Maddie, Curtis and I's um, suggestions on um, good drift spots. These are the drift spots that we hit up the most. Um, so let's get straight into it. So coming in on number five on the list, we have the airport, believe it or not. And the location is right here at the airport. Uh, pause the video if needed right here. This is the spot at the airport. Right as you come in, there's the gate just over there. And it's actually these little pillars here. Now, don't get me wrong, I am... Um, I'm very bad at drifting. Well, not very bad, but I wouldn't class myself as one of the best. But, um, you know, you can obviously drift around these. Uh, there's a few tight corners here and there, as you can see. But, um, yeah, this is, this is a pretty good spot to drift. These are sort of short, consecutive drifts. And then if you got if you really want to, you can obviously fly out here and do um, really big and wide drifts going around here like this, as you can see. Now I'm not good at wide drifts, um, but you know. Uh, so yeah, practice makes perfect. You know what you know what it is. So coming in at number four on the list, guys, we have car parks. Now this can be any car park. I'm just gonna move out of the way here. This can be any car park. It can be ones at the airports here. It can be um, uh, it can be the one like over here somewhere. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's here. Um, but you know, car parks and um, these top deck um, like four level car parks and stuff. Now these are great for sort of losing cops in as well and you can go so many different ways. If you want to you can go around all the way like all the way around like this and then up. Um, you can come up here go this way or you can just go up here go straight uh, there's so many different ways to sort of drift around these parking lots. Um, so yeah, me and Curtis use these a lot for sort of when we're getting away from cops and drifting and playing tag, as you don't, as you guys know, should know by now. Me, Curtis, and Maddie, and a few others every now and then like to play tag in our cars. So um, yeah, that is number four on our list. Okay guys, so coming in at number three on the spot, um, this is my third favourite um, spot for drifting, mostly because it's a really difficult drift, um, but it is, I like to call this the tunnel drift, I don't, I don't, I don't know. So <laughs> if it is located this in this area region of the map at near of Linewood. Um, obviously, if you guys want reference, this is the city in the witty little there. Can I talk, please? This is the weed farm in the city. Um, you can obviously, if I go around here, customs is like just over here, so you can see where it is. Um, 
I honestly like this drift spot mostly because it's just a difficult drift and you can impress a lot of, a lot of friends if you get it right um, and just a little note it you cannot go through this in a banshee um, not sideways like I just did then because you will hit the walls and it will not be pretty at all so you don't want to do that so that is number three on the list okay guys so coming in at number two on the spot we have this parking lot just here um, it is located right here on the map for reference uh, Benny's is right there it's just here um, you have the anime nation with gun store you have the strip club here and it's just in this parking lot here um, this is a pretty good drift spot mostly because of the sharp turns and like this island right here is awesome for drifting around so as you can see right there um, it's just you have so many different ways to go and it's just really good so that is number two on the list okay so now coming in at number one on the list this is um, our favorite our favorite favorite drift spot in the map um, I am missing missing headlights don't worry about that um, this is our favorite drift spot on the map it's actually at um, premium deluxe motorsport or as some people like to call it Simeon's um, there's Benny's right there this is number two on the spot just here he, um, and this is like the alleyway that we drift around now this may not look like an alley good alleyway to drift around but it actually is because um, you got to get that right to sort of come in through here um, you can obviously hit it the way I just did you can come up here jump off this and do like a jump drift I think you call it um, you can also be flying out here, do drifts around these corners, um, coming in on in here. You can maybe try to do 360, um, 360 drifts around here. Um, but it's just a really good drift spot. I mean, it's pretty hard to hit with two people going at it at once. But if you get it right. Like sometimes me and Curtis usually, when we hit this together, I usually come in here. He drifts around, and I just like fishtail out of this. But like I said, there's so many different ways to hit this drift spot, and it's honestly our favorite drift spot, just because of this um, sharp turn here. And yeah, that's so. That's gonna be it for this episode. Um, not episode video, I guess you can say. Um, if you guys liked. Um, enjoyed the video be sure to leave a like and subscribe turn on non post notifications so you get notified each time I upload and once again thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one peace